I'd like to um, follow on from the last video I made where I talked about how many of us just simply get into relationships because of this primal warmth we want to feel, like a, a an unconscious pseudo-psychological warmth that we feel not just when we're with other people platonically, but the most intense one is feeling that warmth being in a relationship with somebody else and how it's just enough to be with them and we don't care about the quality of that relationship or whether or not that person's anything like you. Uh, I've done it a lot. Most people, that's their problem. They don't have any discerning standard because our biology desperately feels like we've won the lottery when we have the proximity of someone, anyone. But the thing is, we need to circumvent that uh, because people just pick anybody and then they kind of feel like, well, it's normal to get frustrated. All relationships are like this. Everyone tells me relationships are like this. Men and women don't get along. It's normal to fight with your partner. Women nag, that's just normal. Relationships are hard work, that's just normal. So all of this headache and nagging and incompatibilities just seen as normal because that's the way it is. And I think a lot of it has to do with accepting anyone who comes along. Monday used to talk about this a lot in um, many of his videos in the past where he couldn't understand where people just accepted whatever came along. And uh, they either tell you you've got your standards are too high or too particular. But it's more that you realize people just accept whoever comes along, call it a relationship and try and fit a square peg into a round hole. Uh, and I think that's most of the frustrations of people. And another thing, I don't care how starving you are. I know that's a hunger to have another person in your life. If someone said you can only pick one meal to eat for the rest of your life, if it was a menu, you wouldn't just pick anything. I'm not telling you what to do, but um, why it's so important not just to pick whoever comes along. Um, it's better to pick nothing pick yourself and your own contented life, your own, your own peace and tranquility, and um, not just to put up with another person just to have them there, just to have some sort of relationship because it feels like there's a warmth there when in fact there really isn't, there's loneliness, there's quiet desperation. So I think this is what happens with a lot of uh, guys. They don't even like the woman we're, they're with, yet they're trying to love her. And they tell you, I, effectively, this is what they're saying. They're saying, I love the woman I can't tolerate, which is I'm trying desperately to love the woman I don't even like. It sounds ridiculous because it is ridiculous. Again, I, I come back to simplicity. Which other relationships in your life are this hard, yet this personal, romantic, deep, meaningful one that it, it should be is the hardest, most frustrating one where you barely even like the person, yet you're around them all the time. You're around the person all the time that you don't even like. Uh, and again, I think it uh, connects back to this biological pull, this primal pull to feel a sort of warmth with a person you call a girlfriend. And it's not enough just to have the object of a relationship in your life. There has to be the substance of the person. Otherwise, you're better off being alone. You truly are. If you can't find someone who resembles a good friend, like just enjoying spending time with them, rather than coming back from work driving back to something else and someone else that seems like another job. Now, nah, F that, man. Stay single. I just don't get people saying, well, this is the way women are. This is the way men are. What are you going to do? I know what you can do. Be on your own. Anyway, let me know if you guys uh, resonate with any of this and let me know your experience. And let me know if you, uh, you enjoy these kind of videos more and you want me to intersperse them 
rather than doing the same old ones where I, I sit in my studio. Anyway, guys, subscribe, hit the like button, give me a thumbs up. It's all free and helps my channel out and um, link my videos around. Share them around with somebody you think might, uh, might benefit from something I've said. And uh, I'll catch you in the next video. Also, if you want to say thank you uh, and support the channel, there are links below. I'll catch you soon, guys. Later.